guys and welcome to the start of the moving vlog. It's currently Monday morning, about three weeks before I actually move, so it does seem quite premature to pack, but I'm heading home to Dubai on Saturday. It's currently Monday. What what is going on here and when i get back from dubai i literally have like seven days until i have to move out and i'm working loads of those seven days so i just thought let's just start a little bit today and if i just do it in little stages it'll be a lot less overwhelming if you are new here welcome my name is lucy thank you so much for joining me today make sure to smash that subscribe button if you haven't already i would love to have you back for more of my videos my life's gonna be quite chaotic for the next few months so i would love you guys to follow along with me and come along for the ride and if you do enjoy this vlog Please do smash it big thumbs up. Who let me know? If you want to know where I'm moving, why I'm moving, what's going on, I've uploaded a video already. So go and check that out. Yes, I haven't lived here very long. But anyway, sometimes life doesn't go as you plan. So my first job is I'm going to start packing up my bathroom because my landlord is actually replacing my bathroom while I'm in Dubai. This was like discussed before we were moving out. This lighting is disgusting, actually. Let's get out of here. Basically, there's like a leak in my shower and the way they're going to have to fix it, they're going to rip out the whole bathroom. But they're doing it while I'm in Dubai. I'm going to get to enjoy it for all of a week, but it means I need to pack up my bathroom before I go to Dubai. So it's a perfect place to start. Since the lighting is so bad in here, I think I'm just going to bring everything into my bedroom. So the main things are these, this. I actually started a little bit last night and packed up my nail polishes, got my Dyson stuff, toothbrush, and all this stuff. I need to put my laundry away. So first job is going to be to bring everything into my bedroom. Okay, so I've got everything from my bathroom. Let's move you to there. And I kind of just need to assess what I need for the next few months. Obviously, I can go and get stuff from storage, but I'd rather not. So my plan is to put stuff into these bags in like categories and try and keep the stuff that I'm going to use in here because it doesn't all fit in here at the moment. So this is the situation. I think I'm just going to start by putting the face cloths all in a Ziploc bag because that's quite easy. I'm not going to take them and then start going going through everything separately. And now that's one empty, woo! Right, I'm gonna carry on with this and I'll update you guys in a bit. So, good progress has been made. This is all my bathroom stuff. I'm just gonna pop this in the bin because it's basically done. This is the stuff I'm keeping out. I need to like arrange it better, but I'm gonna figure out what makeup I'm gonna keep out first and try and get it all in here. Honestly, these have been lifesavers. I know they're not good for the environment, but I had them already, so I might as well use them. So, let me show you my makeup. This is my makeup drawer. It's quite full on. To be honest, do I use half the stuff in here? No. But I don't want to get rid of it because like when stuff finishes I will use it So I'm just gonna take it all out and take it one step at a time But I have only got half an hour till I start coaching and I think this is more than a half an hour job So I'm just gonna put all this stuff away where it's gonna go just for now and then I will deal with it Right got myself some avocado on toast and I'm ready to tackle the makeup I think the strategy that's really low is gonna have to be just take it all out first There's a lot of stuff in here and then figure out what I'm actually gonna need over the next few months Okay, so it actually doesn't look as bad out as it did when it was in the drawer. So basically, I'm going to sort through everything. I've got loads of makeup bags, so I try and put stuff in them. Yeah, and just figure out what I need to take with me. Okay, so it's all sorted into bags now. This is what I'm keeping out of storage. This is the storage boxes. I'm, I'm going to put it all back in the drawer where it was, but at least it's packed and organized. So, update. The top drawer here that was all my makeup and stuff is basically empty. It doesn't even look empty. It's now just the stuff that like I'm going to be taking with me. And in my bathroom, I've just got got these two things now which is the stuff I'm taking this is completely empty the stuff off the top of there is gone this is the, what the stuff's packed into and then that's cleaning stuff I need to put my laundry away still I mean it's not a lot but it's a start my next thought is I'm going to do this unit so that that's done because I think that will be like a lot of effort because it's like my sheet music and I want to organize it before I store it if that makes sense so then when I take it out it's done um also just went out into the corridor and like Ella is in full packing mode because she's leaving this weekend and it's really like sunk in that we're leaving here is ella's life on the floor <laughs> it's crazy i feel like we moved in yesterday and also like you think you're doing oh god i forgot 
So do I. Um, you think you're doing so much, and then like There's you look so around and it's like, I'm just making it worse. Like but I'm actually has, making it worse. But it has to be worse before it gets better. Yeah. It has to be. But like we've lived here for six months. Like it's not a short amount of time. I don't even have that much stuff. But look, like look at the yeah. mess. Like you don't you underestimate how hard. And when everything's in a wardrobe and you take it out, you're like, oh, it's a lot of stuff. And I have a lot of stuff. Look at my like dodgy fake tan. <laughs> Oh, look at that. <laughs> no, I'm a mess. Right, should we go make hot chocolates Let's do while that. we continue? Okay, I totally just got carried away and forgot that I was vlogging, that I was packing stuff. So I can't remember what I last updated you, but I have packed away all of the stuff from these shelves. This is the stuff that I'm keeping out of storage. So that's why that's there. This is the rest of it. These bags are so heavy because they're all books. But anyway, that's that done. I showed you in this drawer already. Rubbish and stuff I've been sorting. I've sorted out all these little boxes. Boxes. So now this is all stationary that is gonna go. This is like miscellaneous stuff and memory box. This is medicines. There's just masks here. Obviously, I'm gonna take them with me, but yeah, that's sorted. That's kind of all I've done, but it is a lot, but it doesn't seem like a lot. I'm basically gonna try and tackle these other two drawers in my desk. I'm just trying to do everything that's like stuff because clothes it's easier you just like put it in a suitcase and you're done but stuff is always the hard stuff to pack so yeah i'm gonna try and deal with this stuff i've got another class in an hour so if i can bash out a little bit more today then i think i'm gonna feel way better and then tomorrow i'm not gonna do any packing i'm just gonna do filming content all that kind of stuff along with a bit of coaching also i don't know if you can see here i've swapped this picture out to a photo of me and jamie because it's the one from winter wonderland on the day that he asked me to be his girlfriend so i thought i'd swap that out because i was taking stuff off my pin board and it was getting a bit bent in the winter wonderland thing i'll show you guys some people might think it's pointless because i'm literally about to move that i've just changed the photo in a frame but i will take the frames with me and then it's just in there anyway look here we are being all cute so that's up there now and yeah i'm gonna do this drawer now which is like cables and miscellaneous stuff like my speaker like i think i'm gonna keep that out of storage but where am i gonna put it Oh, it's very confusing. Anyway, yeah, I'm gonna deal with this drawer and then I'll update you guys. Hey guys, it's now many, many, many days later in this moving vlog. I think the last time I filmed, I was still at the flat. I'm currently at Jamie's. I don't, has Jamie been in a vlog before? I don't remember. Anyway, Jamie is my boyfriend. I'm currently at his flat and we are heading back to my house today to finish my packing. Basically all done. I just need to do the kitchen, my bedding and just double check everything is sorted. And then we're gonna bring some of my stuff back here that's not going into storage and then his uncle is very very kindly coming down with his van tomorrow to my house and is helping me take all my stuff to storage for a little bit and then that is kind of the moving process done i'm not going to fully explain where i'm going what i'm doing at the moment because it's not all confirmed but yeah i'm just done a bit of teaching this morning my arm looks really weird from that angle jamie's away getting his hair cut and then we're just gonna drive down to mine and get packing so it's all sorted and ready for his uncle coming tomorrow because i don't want him to have to like wait while i'm packing i just want everything to be like ready and we can production line it into the van and it can be nice and speedy we are currently at mine packing stuff up i'm just about to strip my bed i think that's gonna be my next job yeah Aye. okay i don't know where i'm at ping you yeah. <laughs> i don't really know what oh my brain's not really working i need to do the kitchen and the rest of the stuff here take my curtains off cool that's the plan i want to be for the rest of my life oh i know you know you are on my life so here we have eleanor ordering a starbucks uh lucy is is here yeah, packing and yeah, i'm and you're and, not helping and i'm not helping <laughs> Gonna get fired. <laughs> so this is the current situation. All the bags around here. We need to take the curtains off. This is the stuff I'm taking today. This is the we've got our lunch with us that we made last oh. night. Oh, you're gonna drop it. Careful. Eleanor ordered Starbucks, so I got our chocolate cream with no cream with vegan cream made with oat milk, and it's very good. We're just gonna take a break and go have lunch, but we're pretty much done to be fair. I just need to finish organizing and then do the kitchen stuff, do the fridge, and that's it. Really. Really? So that is us done for today. Everything is all in its place, ready for tomorrow for Jamie's uncle to come with the van. Oops, this has fallen over. Jamie's just gone around to get the car. Then we're gonna put some stuff in and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Oh, I'm knackered. Uh, we're doing this because Lucy says she wanted to do carpool karaoke. We could actually do a carpool karaoke like this. It's quite a good angle. Is it? 
Yeah. I can't look because I'm driving. No, so. I know, I don't look. Yeah. Can I turn this down, please? Okay. Anyway, we are currently on our way home to Jamie's. We've got some of my stuff in the back and my suitcase in the boot. I don't think Jamie's flat's going to know what's hit it really when I bring all my stuff in. Um, not all of it. And then we're going to meet his parents and I think we might get a Domino's for dinner and chill and watch Trigger Point. So we watched a few episodes of it last night and it was very, very good. <laughs> we will see you guys tomorrow ready for the final moving day. Woo! Hello everybody, it's now the next day. I definitely forgot to charge my camera because I'm an absolute idiot. It's a very sunny day. I'm also wearing the exact same clothes I wore yesterday. But Jamie and I are nearly at the house. We're three minutes away and his uncle and his dad are in a van. They will be here shortly. So we're gonna start the moving and it's the final day. Poor Jamie has driven again today. He's gonna have driven how many hours? Like eight hours in two days? Yeah, maybe. I'll work it out later and come back to you. Come back to me on how bad it's been. Yeah, um, <laughs> yeah we'll keep you updated. Just kind of want to get in and get it done. So I don't know how yeah, much what, I'll me? film. How much you been? Got some background music going on. <laughs> um, yeah, so I'll update you guys when we get there. For the last time entering Tooting Beck. Here we go. Right, we have made it, Mattingbird Way, for the last time. It's been a quick and very interesting <laughs> six months, but it's a weird, it's like, I'm not sad about leaving, but it is like a little bit sad because I have had some nice memories here. It's like the last time I'm gonna be living with Eleanor and Reese. If you guys have watched me for a while, you'll know I've lived with them for four years now. So this is the house, the second one here, number nine. It's a nice sunny day, um, but yeah, let's go in and get sorted. Look at the doggy. Hi, doggo. Hi. <laughs> right, I'm gonna head in. I'm gonna start bringing stuff down. Jamie's uncle and his dad should be here in about 10 minutes. Right, this is the current situation. It doesn't look like that much stuff, I don't think. So, should we start carrying some bags down? Right, I didn't film any of the packing, but this is it. All empty. You guys haven't seen my bathroom since it's been kind of redone, but like the paint is a bit. There we go. <sighs> Goodbye. Number nine. Massing bird way. Eight, nine, why have I forgotten what number I live at? Here was my little view. It's a nice day today. Yeah, that's it. See you later. Obviously got to take my fan. There they are. I'm gonna leave them here on the bed for the new occupant. Oh my God, absolutely sweating. I'm not gonna give you a house tour because no one else has moved out yet. I mean, Gabby has, but the rest haven't moved out and the new one of the new girls has moved in. So don't wanna show you their space. But that's me. Done. Goodbye, Massing Bird Way. The move is done. I didn't really vlog that much because it was very much military operation. We'd just been for a cheeky McDonald's. I've got an Oasis. Jamie had a McFlurry. We literally got the van packed in like 20 minutes, which was mental. And now we're just heading back to Jamie's mum and dad. Jamie's dad and uncle are in the van. They're gonna meet us there. We're gonna have some lunch there and have a little rest. And then we're going to drive to the storage unit and put everything in there. But yeah, it's been very, very efficient. Oh, now we're, we're going. Moving. We are moving now. It's been very, very efficient. And yeah, very good so far, which makes me very worried something's gonna go wrong. I, I just don't trust myself. Right, we're at the storage place. Got the first load of stuff from the van. Here is my unit. To be fair, it's pretty big. Like, I'm doing all right. So here we go. This is it empty. Let's see when it's full. Right, I'm getting there. Jamie's just brought more stuff up. This is the current situation. It's going well so far, I think. I feel like this is enough space. Just need to get these guys in. Chest of drawers. And I think we're good. Right, I think you can tell I've done this before. There we go. We've just got a bit of furniture to go. And that's it. Done. Absolutely smashed it. And I just said to Jamie, I think I need to get more stuff because it's not full. Woo!